everybody. Hello everyone. I'm Maz. I'm Liz. And welcome to our fifth session of Books and Babies. It's lovely to have you here. For those of you that may not have seen the previous videos, a quick recap on what we're doing. So it's about books and babies and it's introducing you to songs and to books and really spending some quality time with your little ones. Now, we talked last week about repetition but we've decided we're not going to sing the same songs this week. Yeah. We're going to introduce you to some, you may know them, um, but just feel free to sing along, join in the actions, make sure your little ones can see you and just have a really good fun time with your, with your babies. So we're going to start with a hello song and this includes your baby's name. So where we say a name, obviously, you would be saying the name of your little one. Yeah. Okay. And I think we have some little friends out there already, don't we? I think we, we do, yes. So All right. Do you know. see Lily? Maybe Lily might be watching or James might be watching today. And Freddie. And Freddie as well. So we let's will see. sing hello to Lily. Yes. Hello, Lily. favourite this week Absolutely. as well though. Yes. So we're going to do Bar Bar Black Sheep. And we do two versions, don't we Liz? We do. We do one for the little boy who lives down the lane and one for the little girl who lives, lives down, down the, the lane. lane. Ready? Ready? Bar Bar Black Sheep, have you any wool? Yes sir, yes sir, three bags full. One for the master and one for the dame And one for the little boy who lives down the lane Bar, bar, black sheep, have you any wool? Yes sir, yes sir, three bags full One for the master and one for the dame and one for the little girl who lives down the lane. Yay! Fantastic! And then this week next, we thought we'd introduce you to some colour. You may see our lovely colourful background that we've got here. So we're going to sing a rainbow. Absolutely. Are you ready, Mars? I think so, yeah. Ready? Okay. 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 Red and yellow and pink and green, purple and orange and blue. I can sing a rainbow, sing a rainbow, sing a rainbow too. Should we sing that one again? I'd like to. I really like yeah. that one. I'm practicing the actions, I'm getting there with it. So let's try again, okay. Red and yellow and pink and green, purple and orange and blue. I can sing a rainbow, sing a rainbow, sing a rainbow too. Oh, that was really lovely. I enjoyed that. That was lovely. I did too. And after we've had our little sing song. We then wind down a little bit and have a look at the books. Yeah. So this one is a black, black yeah. and white yeah. book. Some of you may have picked these up from your local library, so you can have a look through it with us. So we spoke last week about talking about the number of spots. We counted them. One, two, three. In die tree and we did as well around
hands around the garden. So we can use our hand or we can trace it around on the book and do round and round the garden like a teddy bear. One step, two step, tickle me under there. there. <laughs> oh, it always makes me tickle anyway. Me too. Oh, and you may have remembered from a couple of weeks ago that we talked about facial expressions and we were sticking our tongue out at our babies. To see if once, you know, they may well join in with that as well. So you will have noticed that when Liz and I are doing our songs, we do do lots of actions. And Liz is going to tell you a little bit more about what it is and why we do these actions for you. The actions, or rather the signs that we're doing, are makaton. Makaton is a simpler form of communicating, generally for young children and even young adults. And it's for people who struggle to communicate, whether they have a hearing impediment or some learning disabilities. But what we're hoping to do is help you pick up some of these signs and that your children will also pick up, even though they may not have the need to use it themselves. They will be going off to school or to the park with children who perhaps are signing. And I think once you show your children young enough, they'll be able to communicate with their friends. And so hopefully we'll give you some tips yes. on the market on. Let's hope so. Yeah. Well, oh, just a quick reminder as well. If you'd like to um, get your books and babies pack, you can pop into any of them. Well, give, give your local oral library a call and you'll be able to pick, pick up one of these books from there so you can join in with us as well. It's been really lovely this week again. Thank lovely. you very much. And hoi revoir. We'll Hoyle see you soon. Bye-bye. See you soon. Bye.